Hey, what's up fam? How y'all doing? We back at it again out here behind Old Hickory Dam. Look what we got with us. What's up? What's up? What's up? East side, baby. <laughs> Old Sam Shady with us. We got out here trying our luck behind the dam for a few bluegills. But this is what we got going on. Waiting for this barge to go through. It's probably going to sit here for about another hour or so before it goes through and uh, we're just piddling around but I want to show you guys something this is one of the most beautiful pumpkin seeds I've ever caught in my life check this out that's good look at this fish hold on Look at this fish. Ah. Oh, I dropped my phone in the water. Look at the colors on this fish. Wow. Is that not a beautiful, beautiful fish? All right, we're going to get him back. And uh, God bless and thanks for watching. All right, y'all, we ain't doing too bad considering the barge sitting there. I got a couple big blacks that I caught on the bottom. Crickets on the bottom. Yep. All right. So since the fish aren't biting, I'm gonna try and catch this little baby turtle. Sitting on a rock right there. See if I can catch him. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. <laughs> My little 12 year old daughter was here, she would go crazy. <laughs> Pretty little turtle. All right. Hey y'all, it's been a rough day so far. I only have six fish. <laughs> well, we're gonna keep at it. We're gonna keep at it. Nice crappie. You know you gotta have a minnow. Huh? When you pass down, Sam, pass over the course to the left. The fish ain't where I'm at now. The fish is to the left.
Yeah. You got your beads set, though? Yeah. Woo! Yeah, they had to wait for that bar to leave. They was probably killing it before that bar came, too. Say the cuss word. What's Man. wrong? <laughs> Why didn't you get my father, Sam? Go it out as far as you can. Hang up the rocks where you are. Put your bead all the way down, throw it out as far as you can. Can't throw them out. And it's clean. No, it's dead. I'm told you I'm grabbing the dead ones. The dead ones stink. I don't mind, they just, they just see the, the legs. Yeah, yeah. Like a thing. Yeah, they can These bluegills, y'all. Slab, baby. Slab holes. I can't even get my hand around it. Look at it. He's peeing on the phone. He's peeing got, on the phone. We got one. Whoa! That's Trey. You give me that one, I give you this one. <laughs> <laughs> Another wonderful day, and these are bigger than the ones yesterday. What's wrong? No. <laughs> I know you tried to do that, huh? I was going to do that anyway. I know. <laughs> I, you know, I know. <laughs> I was too stupid to realize that. this is the slip float. This is a long pole. So the slip float on this one can reach the bottom. Another slab old. Another slab old dab old.
That I waited for, Sam. Mm -hmm. Sogers and the bluegill. Y'all can have their own. Buffalo, catfish, carp. I think you got a bite, too. You got a bite. A pole. A fish on there? like somebody else. Drag on it. Drag on it. Uh, they don't understand what you're saying. Let's keep going. <laughs> Let's see Just go to the other pole and leave that one so you can keep fishing. Let it How pretty they look in the water. Thank you. 
Ooh, I wish y'all could see how big these fish are. The phone doesn't give the real scale. Look at that bluegill. Mm, mm, mm. I said, no, I'm saying, yeah. yeah. I know that. I said, you know, they can have it. I think I feel like this, bro. Yeah. Hey, wait. Take that some worms up over there. They did anyway. You think they can help? Huh? They did. No, I'm talking about they're leaning over. I know. They ain't going to. These bluegills, y'all. Oh, oh, oh. oh, my God. Look how fat. Look at the backs on them. Oh, oh. They didn't get these to one. <laughs> I'm going to throw it right back out there to it. Let his brother get it. All right, guys, back home. We fished from about 11 a.m. until dark. <laughs> you know, this is this fishing is addictive, man. I got to I got to slow down. But anyone who fishes knows how it can be. We have 35 bluegill and a crappie. And um, 
Yeah, it's nine. It's nine forty-three p.m. <laughs> and I got a lot of work to do. But um, yeah. So let me get to it. I just want to say thanks to all the people who watch these videos. Thanks to to all the people who are subscribing. I really appreciate it. My channel is not monetized and it never will be. I do this just for fun and to entertain my family and friends. And I hope you enjoy the videos too. God bless. Um, I won't be eating no fish tonight like last night. I'm eating a TV dinner. <laughs> I'm going to clean these fish and I'm going to bed. And like I always say, every fish you see here is already promised to either family members or friends and I haven't even started on collecting the fish for my church members. I joined a church in January and I got saved and uh, at Grace Apostolic Church in Nashville, Tennessee. Come and visit us sometimes and um, I got to get uh, promise those guys uh, some of those people fish too. So yeah I'm not hoarding fish by any stretch of the imagination. Like I said, 85%, maybe 95% of the fish that we catch is gifted to other people who aren't as fortunate as we are. And we catch so many fish that we, we're blessed. So we don't have to hoard fish. And um, everything is um, harvested in a sustainable method. Uh, these bluegills have no limit. We always abide by all the rules and regulations on size length everything creole limit every we don't we are we are a one fishermen we don't break any rules and we love the environment and we want to keep it the way it is but anyway um that's a little long-winded i'm about to get busy i'm gonna eat first and uh once again i love y'all and thanks for watching um god bless you and your family Jesus loves you. He always has. Give him a chance. Give him a chance. All right. Good night. Not done yet. Not yet. All right. These are the fillets from the day before yesterday. Or yesterday rather and they've soaked in salt water so now I'll soak them in clear tap water overnight because I don't want them to be too salty these are the fillets from today nice mess I think there's 35 in here. And what I'll do is start the process of soaking these overnight in salt water. And this bag of goodness right here, that's for my man, my man Sam Shady. I know y'all didn't think I was going to leave him hanging, did y'all? <laughs> All right, now I'm done.